So let's make a custom logo. Just go to Logo Maker without the E, L O G O M A K R dot com and then click start my design. To look for a graphic, just go up to the top and type in the graphic you want. I'm gonna type in tree. All right, I want this one, so I'm gonna click on it. To move it around, you could just click, drag, and hold and move it around. Just go ahead and click on the edges to make it bigger or smaller like that. I'm gonna put it in the middle. Now I'm gonna add some text below. So just go ahead and click on the T and I'm gonna move it down just like that. And I'm gonna put tree logo. There you go. If you wanna change the font, you could go to the category and you could change the font just like this. I actually like that bold font, so I'm gonna go back to that bold font and I'm gonna go down to Helvetica. That's a good one. Okay, now to change the color, just go over to the color wheel and you could change the color here. I want a brown color, so I'm gonna do that. There you go. To align this, click hold and drag so you could highlight everything. Click on this and then click on align. There you go. I'm gonna push it down just a little bit more. Now I'm gonna add some more text down below. So I'm gonna go back to the T over here and I'm gonna put in my tagline. There you go. I put in my tagline. I'm gonna make it a little smaller now. There you go. Now I wanna make my tagline a different color. So there you go. And I'm gonna change the font to a thin font. That's pretty nice. There you go. Now that looks like a decent logo. If you wanna add a shape to the background, all you have to do is go over to the shapes here. I'm gonna add a square to the background. I'm gonna drag, click, drag and hold like that. I'm gonna change the color to a different color. Maybe I want it kind of yellow-ish. Then I'm gonna go ahead and right click or you could go right here, click the option area and click send to back. It will send that to the back. I'm gonna make this a little bit bigger. I'm gonna drag and hold these little edges right here to make it a little bit better. And I wanna round the corners of this. So I'm gonna to go to styles and I'm gonna click roundness. There you go. Now I have some round corners around it. That looks pretty good. But let's say I wanted a border around this. Easy, just go over here to the outline and I'm going to add a border, maybe a brown border by choosing a color and then going to line width right here. And I could add a line width to this. Wow, that looks pretty amazing. Let's say you wanted to undo a change that you made. Let's say, for example, you did this, but you wanted to go back. All you have to do is click undo right here and it will go right back to that area. To delete something, all you have to do is click this and click that delete button here or at the bottom, delete, and there you go. To save this logo, all you have to do is go up to the top right and click save. And you can see what it's gonna look like on mugs, banners, t-shirts, and so on. This is really nice. To get the high resolution for your website, for printing, and so on, just click this button and it'll give you the professional files for this. You get royalty free. Also, for the low resolution, you could click on this button, but you're gonna have to follow the legal terms here to use that on your website. If you love your logo, I'd recommend getting the high resolution files so you could get it royalty free for your commercial and personal use. So here's an example of the high resolution and vector files that you will receive when you get the professional files. Notice it never gets blurry. When I zoom in on this, it never gets blurry. And these are professional grade files that you get when you get the high resolution royalty free version, meaning you own the license and you don't have to attribute credit to us, nothing. And this works great for professional websites and printing. So I would recommend getting that version. And if you like our team to create a custom design for you, all you have to do is click here where it says custom design service. It will go here. We explain what we do in this video, but overall we're going to give you unlimited presentations and you get high end graphic designers. So each and every one of these designs are created from scratch so that you could copyright the designs and they fit your industry and your brand. So within two to three days, we will present you with four to six custom presentations that we created from scratch. So instead of hiring a graphic designer and paying them per hour, you're gonna get unlimited graphics and presentations from our professional team that you could trademark because everything is done from scratch. If you're interested, just go ahead and click the custom design link here and we're here to help.